before causing this leak. And that is definitely the reason why the cylinder number one has no compression. So what that means for me is I've got to go ahead and remove the head and, um, and pretty much rebuild the head, put a new set of valves in there, uh, make sure that the head is nice and level, and also make sure while I'm in there that the bores of the cylinder are all in good condition. So that's pretty much it for now. Um, I'll get back to you later, once I get the heads off. Later.